Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. I'm starting off this video, it's Saturday morning. I'm about to start cooking breakfast. I have the oven preheating right now for some bacon and it's a really nice day outside, which the weather said otherwise. So that's always good. I'm probably going to take my car to get it washed today. It's been a few months <laughs> since I've gotten it washed. Other than that, I don't really have plans. We're going to eat Mexican for dinner, which I'm excited about. I like planned it. I was like, we're going to Agave Azul, which is one of the best Mexican places in Orlando, in my opinion. And we're going there for dinner. I'm getting a skinny margarita, I'm getting my taco salad, I'm getting chips, salsa, guac, all the things, and having myself a night. It's all I want. Other than that, no plans, which is good, because we've been doing stuff the past few weekends. I had yesterday off of work, I just sat, watched YouTube videos all day. I did go to the gym, which was surprising. I was super motivated yesterday to go to the gym, which I usually don't work out on Fridays usually just work out Monday through Thursday, but I was in the mood to get a good workout in, so I did. I kind of want to edit my YouTube video, try and get it up, so maybe I'll put aside some time to edit, do a thumbnail, stuff like that. I'm wearing this cute little sports bra that's doubling as like a just a leisure top from Set Active. Set Active is one of my favorite activewear brands and like loungewear i feel like it doubles as just like a cute top i love their sculpt flex collection it's what i'm wearing right now and i have like five pairs of leggings five sports bras i have like three biker shorts i love 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 set active i feel like it's just really flattering the colors are just incredible just a little just I feel like it's so supportive as a one shoulder as well like I feel like I could run in this and it won't like nothing will pop out which I love I just made a breakfast quesadilla for Christian and I kind of showed the process but it's really easy you kind of need a small pan so that way the egg fits the quesadilla these are the tortillas that we use they're the siete almond flour ones it's the smaller size it's really small it's probably the size of my hand and then just do a small pan with egg some pepper we put bacon in the oven and then crumble it on top. He does cheese on his. And then you kind of just cook the tortilla in another pan and then you flip the egg and just put it on the circle tortilla, if that makes sense. I kind of showed it. I did my egg and pepper and bacon and cheese on a gluten-free English muffin by the Food for Life brand. These are in the frozen food section. They're kind of hard. They're not the best. Christian hates them, thinks they're so gross. I mean, I don't mind them. I think they're fine. Um, and then the cheese that I'm using, this is probably the best dairy-free cheese that I have found. It's really good, definitely by no means healthy. It has a lot of chemicals in it, but it's really good on a breakfast sandwich. So I have that in there. Some crumbled up bacon, some avocado, everything but the bagel seasoning on an English muffin. It's really good. We're in the car. We're going to get a car wash. I don't even want to show you the inside of my car because it is so dirty. I have not gotten my car cleaned since last year, which is really bad. And so the mats on the inside are dirty. I have those weatherproof mats, which makes it good, but obviously the interior of my car is completely black, so I'm not really worried about the mats, but I have the weatherproof mats, and they're just, they have dirt, sand, stuff, all at the bottom of them, 
I'm, it's dusty in here. The outside of my car is just gross. So we're gonna go get it washed at my favorite car wash. I've actually been going to this car wash for a really long time. Even before I could drive, my mom would actually go here. So I've known about this car wash for a really long time, always gone. They um, do such a great job. It's called Images. It's by Baldwin Park if you live in Orlando. Seriously, one of the best car washes and they do detailing as well. I haven't done their detailing, but I think Maya has done it, one of my friends. So they do a really good job, never disappoint. So I'm gonna take my car there and then I will feel so much better. I'm gonna go do that and then, I don't know, maybe get a Starbucks because we're out and then maybe go to Target and get some stuff because I need some like new lotion, new face wash. There was one other thing that I needed and I can't remember. Maybe we'll remember while we're out. If not, I can always go tomorrow um, and hopefully I think of it by then <laughs> because I know I need three things, so. I don't love this angle. I just don't want to put my car mount on my freshly cleaned window. So this is how it's going to be while I order Starbucks. Hee hee hee. Car is clean. The mats look so good. The inside looks good. The outside is sparkling, glowing. Oh, I need to download money on my app. That will be it. Thank you. Just went down to my mailbox and got a few things. I got a package from 1UP Nutrition. If you guys remember, I think it was a work week of my life video from the beginning of the year. I got into, like I'm into supplements this year and making sure I'm just getting what I need. Yeah, so I started taking a greens powder by 1UP Nutrition and have been absolutely loving it. This is my fourth container of it. This is gonna be my fourth month. And I get it in the lemonade flavor. I have it right now in the pineapple flavor. So I just gotta refill up on it. The pineapple flavor is so good. I drink it warm. I know that sounds so weird, but I drink it warm because I have warm lemon water in the morning. So I kind of, what I do is I fill up a glass of water, put the greens powder in, heat it up in the microwave, and then squeeze half a lemon in the cup. I don't wanna have like four liquids in the morning because I do chlorophyll water, I do the greens powder, I was doing lemon water, and then I have my coffee, and I just thought that would be too much. So I just combined my warm lemon water and the greens, and I've been loving it. I really feel like, and I, I get it, it's way better to get your greens in through your diet, your fruits and vegetables. It's so much better to be eating whole foods rather than supplementing it, but you just can't do it all, you know? Like, you can't, you can't, you can't do it all. So I supplement because I know for a fact I'm not eating enough fruits and vegetables throughout the day. And that's totally okay. I know that I'm eating healthy, whole foods when I can. It's all about balance. And if I wanna supplement it, I totally can. And I have seriously seen a difference in my skin. Like I feel like I glow my digestion so much better. And with cutting out other foods that I'm sensitive to. So I don't wanna stop taking it. I really do enjoy the vegan red and green superfoods and I feel like it's just a great way to just get that extra stuff in. This is just something that I've been using for the past since January and loving it. Anyways, I just got a refill on it so I wanted to say that if you're wondering, I literally take this every day or if you're wondering what the greens I take every day or every morning is that you see in the vlogs, it's the one of nutrition. I'll link it down below. I really do enjoy it. So. I did want to share because I just got a restock in the mail 
and I love it. So the pineapple flavor and the lemonade flavor are really good. I haven't tried any other flavors besides these. The lemonade just makes the most sense because I drink it with um, my warm lemon water. So that's why I originally got the lemonade flavor, but they were out of stock of that. So I got the pineapple and I love the pineapple as well. I know they have mango, guava, they have so many flavors. I think they have a non-flavored one as well, but so Christian's down at the pool. It's almost three o'clock. I'm gonna probably start editing or finish editing my YouTube video. And then Mexican food for dinner. I look like Malibu Barbie. Okay, so um, just changed into an outfit for dinner. We're going to Agave Azul, the best Mexican restaurant. And I'm just wearing this little cropped sweater from Misguided. It's kind of lightweight and I feel like it's gonna get a little bit colder as the night goes on. Anyways, it's super lightweight wearing these Abercrombie and Fitch jeans, just some sandals. Gonna pair it with this little Louis Vuitton bag. I took the long strap off, so I'm just doing it with a little chain. Check out Christian's shoes. Love. Love. <laughs> and these are Lululemon, right? Mm hmm Those are really nice. I like those too. So, we're gonna meet Maya at Agave. I don't know if she's bringing anyone, but we're gonna meet her there. I miss her. Haven't seen her in a few weeks, so I'm excited to see her, but I'll link this little sweater down below, and I'll link the jeans for you guys. But I'm excited. Wanna... Skinny margarita and tons of guac and tons of salsa. So I'm so excited. got back from lunch we got jersey mics for lunch just got back i'm doing some laundry i didn't start it yet because i think i'm about to do like film a tiktok i don't know who i am <laughs> um so i got this poppy classic cola prebiotic soda i love the poppy sodas prebiotic bubbly drinks they're so good all the flavors are incredible so I picked up the classic cola one. I am such a soda girl and it's really bad and it's a habit that I have gotten out of and now I just do it as like an every once in a while but I kid you not I used to drink soda every single day. So I love finding alternatives to soda because I love me a soda. So I got the classic cola one and I think I'm gonna try it taste test it on TikTok and give my thoughts over there. And then I will fill you guys in after I do the TikTok. So, because I'm just gonna, I'm trying to have fun with TikTok and just kind of make it whatever I want. Kind of do it laid back, fun stuff that's kind of different. I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna do that. I'll let you guys know how it is after I try it. Okay, I just finished making the TikTok. I actually need to start the dryer <laughs> now that I'm done. But um, my full thoughts and review of it are over there, but it's good. But check out my TikTok. <laughs>
I just got out of Target. I got the coffee because Christian's sister and his niece are coming into town tonight and we're going to dinner and then like a late fireworks show at Disney around like nine o'clock I think. I'm not sure exactly where it is or what we're doing but I needed the energy. Two Starbucks coffees in a weekend. I don't know who I am. Not, not me. Not normally me. <laughs> Christian and I just filmed a funny TikTok, so go check it out. I'll link my TikTok down below. Oh, it was so funny. Mm -hmm. 